I can't believe you guys ditched me yesterday. I almost entered a world I want nothing to do with. What are you talking about? Nothing. Just start it up, Yusuke. Okay, I entered Kaneshiro's name into the nav. And just as expected, it's a hit. Hold on. Wait, wait, wait. You telling me that the nav will give you a hit based just on someone's name? Couldn't you literally just type in people's names at random until you got a hit to find a target? Like, obviously you can't go to the palace until you have the area of distortion and what their desire is or something like that. Yeah, something, something like that. Like, the actual mental distortion as well as the uh, what they see the area as, the physical distortion. But if you can under but if you can know there's a palace based just on the name, that's a lead. That's something you can exploit. All we need now are the two other keywords. What he thinks of as his palace and where it is. But we don't have any clues other than people falling victim around here. Eh, we'll just have to try whatever keywords we can come up with. Ah, oh, that's gonna be impossible. How many buildings do you think there are in Shibuya? No complaining. If we can figure out what the palace is, we may be able to guess where it is by association. Oh, D did we not get a hit on the nav there? I thought the distortion was Shibuya. Hmm, it's probably somewhere he's got complete control over. Maybe a garden? No candidates found. He likes money, so what about a money bath? I've seen people online with things like that. No candidates found. No, not even close. How about it? Can you think of anything? Like, the actual answer is a bank. I'm, I'm curious to see what happens with the mansion, though. No, not even close. How about it? Oh, wow, just repeating the line. Okay, fine. Bank. I see. Candidate found. Okay, that's a hit. So, he thinks of somewhere in this city as his own bank. I thought it would be something less realistic. That's all it is, huh? Now then, what location would Kaneshiro think of as his bank? If we're talking about a place where he keeps his cash, maybe his own hideout? How about a real bank? Oh yes, the distortion of this bank is a bank. His cognition wouldn't be distorted in that case. Damn it, we ain't getting anywhere. This may be difficult to explain, but doesn't it seem we're thinking a little too inside the box? Palaces emanate a passionate madness. It feels as though we're missing that aspect. The hell are you talking about? This palace is a bank for someone who extorts money with criminal acts. It's something more... High schooler. But what other ways can we think about it? Oh, could it mean a place you withdraw money? Hold on. Do you think it might have something to do with the victims? He's taking money from his victims' wallets, right? That means his bank is wherever they are. That's terrible. But you may just be right. Oh, come on! How many people do you think Kaneshiro's taken advantage of in all of Shibuya? Result found. Wait a second. No, bullshit! I called that out two minutes ago. He said Shibuya earlier. I have a hit. Huh? Oh, wait, what? D did I say something right? The place that Kaneshiro thinks of as a bank is all of Shibuya. What? Like, the entire city? I see. That's certainly where his victims are. It turns out he really is a terrible criminal. But wait, is it okay for us to go into the palace right out of a crowd like this? We do it all the other times, why not? Eh. Nobody notices if a piece of trash disappears from a trash can. This ain't any different. As a quick note, because I noticed this in the uh, last uh, couple of days of Persona 5 here, when we went to Mementos literally yesterday, there was someone who froze right in front of us during the, during the Mementos transition screen. 
Like, there is no way in hell that they didn't notice us. We're about to go to the palace, aren't we? Oh shit, it's Sunday. Oh well, it's scripted, so I can't do anything about it. Anyway, but yeah, like, there is no way in hell that person wouldn't have noticed four teenagers and a cat just blink out of existence. In that case, let's go. Beginning navigation. Also, I thought that we determined from the first palace that the range on the nav sucks people in at, like, five or ten meters. Are, are the other civilians not going to get sucked into this? What are those? Walking ATMs. That must be his cognition of people. So this is what Konoshiro considers a bank. I never thought it would be the entire district. Look around us. The distortion is affecting the whole of Shibuya. Huh? What do you mean? Oh, that's right. Even when we were in the castle and the museum, the city outside looked normal. He sees everyone in Shibuya as his patron. His walking money bank. Oh, if he's somewhat redundant, whatever. No surprise for a mafia boss. It's best we focus on finding Kanashiro's location and stealing his treasure as soon as possible. Yeah, his hideout's gotta be somewhere around here. Let's go look for it. Here's a hint. It's really fucking obvious. In any case, let's look for a bank. There should be a huge one around here somewhere. Metaverse Central Street. Hell yes. Hey. Look at that person trembling over there. Do you think he's a victim? We should talk to him. Uh. Do these guys even have mouths? Excuse me, can we... Uh, please forgive me. What happened? You know, no, where's Kaneshiro? It's his palace. We already know that he's going to be a name here. I don't have any more, please. I'm telling you, not even one yen. Come on, man. Oh, cool. We're not trying to mug you or anything. Please, I don't want to end up like the others. Were you assaulted? Shriek. <sighs> There's no doubt he's a victim, but he can't even get a hold of a goddamn conversation. <sighs> Try someone else. Are those... No! This is terrible. All these are real people, right? I mean, technically, they're shadows. It's Kaneshiro's cognition of the people. So they would be mentally broken like these ATM people, but they are not the actual people. What the hell? I don't think we can talk to any of the ones here. All these guys kind of shows victims. It would appear to be that would appear to be the, to be the case. There's nobody we can speak to, let alone a bank anywhere. Joker, let us try checking around the station once more. We may have overlooked something important. Back in this direction. Wait. Oh, look. Do you think that person's a victim too? Excuse us. Excuse me. Can we have a word? We are... It's no use. It's all over. I'll just end up like them. What happened? Can't you tell? I've fallen, fallen so far. From a place where Kanashiro leaves no tracks. What do you mean? Hmm. What could that mean? Hey, you gotta tell us a little more than... I'm too tired. Please let me rest. I don't think he can speak anymore. Kind of share leaves no tracks? Does he mean that literally, literally, or could it be figuratively? Hey. Hey, why don't we go over all the intel we have now? Hmm. They've apparently fallen quite far. Wait a second. They've fallen from a place that kind of Shiro doesn't leave any tracks? Does that mean they were actually thrown down from somewhere up high? Uh... 
Wait, you mean like a skyscraper? Uh, there ain't any of them around here, I don't think. I mean, what's the definition of a sky? It, it doesn't, isn't, this, isn't a skyscraper at least uh, 50 meters tall or something, which is like uh, 10 floors? Uh, a 10 floor skyscraper is very short, but I think it's the minimum requirement. No. Wait, what's that? Is that it? Y'all just completely missed the flying saucer. Looking up is hard, okay? Up in the air. No wonder we couldn't find it. Kind of sheer doesn't leave any tracks, huh? Figures it'd be floating. So, uh, how do we get up there? Can you turn into a helicopter, Morgana? No, just a car. You're useless! Come on! Don't you have some kind of secret gadget or something? Ryuji, we don't get a grappling hook until Persona 5 Royal. And yes, seriously. Shut it! I'm not some robot cat! I mean, I'm not a cat at all! This may be the limit of what we can do today. <sighs> we gotta find a way to get up there. Let's think about it some more tomorrow, okay? Alright, we should get out of here for now. Run for it! Why? Nothing's after us. Hell, why were we dressed as thieves there if the palace ruler doesn't think of us as, as uh, enemies yet? I have a new message from Oya. Evening! Is that, is that woman who reeks of alcohol? You free? Yep. Alright, have a bit of advice for you. It's about that kind of Shiro guy. He's more dangerous than I thought. The police haven't tracked him down yet, so I dug a little deeper. Turns out he has some real shady connections. I won't say any more than that. Shady connections? He's not someone a teenager like you should mess with. You should really back off, okay? Well, that's all I want to say. See ya. Man. Proving our justice isn't going to be easy. We better discuss this with everyone tomorrow. Don't send me to sleep. God damn it. Oh. Just when we find the palace. It's all the way up in the sky. What a pain. I'm sure the police are tired of this guy too. Well then. That reminds me, home shopping program was there today. <laughs> yeah, that reminds you of home shopping, okay. Fine, what's up? Shopping, here's there 20 boxes of mental floss? Nah. It's some kind of HP heal. Check the plant. Nice. Good. Cannot zoom out, so we can't meet with uh, Yoshida. Damn. Can I leave? Hey. No. Can I make? No. Can I train? Hey. No. Can I contemplate? Hmm. Didn't expect that palace to be floating in the sky. Damn, I can barely even contemplate. Let's do it. Fine. I'll save and go to sleep. Come on, there we go. Well, then. We can't do anything if we can't infiltrate the palace. We'll have to think of something. I've been thinking lately. About those phantom thieves, I mean. If Dad were still alive... Sorry, I... I shouldn't bring this up while we're eating. It's okay. Keep going. I just wonder if... He would have been on their side. That's all. The only reason you have time to think about that is because you depend on someone else. Sai, be less of a bitch. That's not... You don't have to do a single thing, and you're provided with food, clothes, a home. I've had no time to think on such ridiculous thoughts. Would Dad have been happy with them? I don't care. He died upholding some lofty sense of righteousness, leaving all his responsibilities on us. Uh, all I was trying to say was... Isn't it about time you grew up and acknowledged our situation? Right now, you're useless to me. Thank you, guardian and parental figure. All you do is eat away at my life. Hey, Makoto, want to live in LeBlanc for a while? Sorry. 
sorry. That was uncalled for. I'm just... really tired. I'll be eating dinner out from tomorrow on. Uh.